What's up Atlanta? I'm Bo. I'm the art director for the Georgia Voice and this is the Georgia Voice Hot Minute. Because we're f***ing flaming! I know we're a little late in filming our latest Hot Minute largely because we've been very busy shooting and celebrating this year's Best Of winners. Wait, wait, photographing, not shooting. We haven't been shooting anyone. Photographing this year's Best Of winners. Photographing. It all started last week with a quick cover shoot in Piedmont Park with several of our Best of Atlanta winners. We had Atlanta Bugs, Joe and Jonathan, trans rocker Amber Taylor, Mr. and Miss Atlanta Eagle, trans activist Tracy McDaniel, and the woman voted by you as this year's Best of Atlanta icon, Atlanta's most famous stripper, Blondie. And then we paused to reflect on the diversity that our Best of Atlanta brings together. Would these people have been in the same room together otherwise? How can we work to bring more people like this together at one time in one place? Oh, I know, a free liquor party! <laughs> we personally served our community, and ourselves, hundreds of glasses of vodka and wine and tried to film a hot minute. Emphasis on try. Roll it, killers! What's up, Atlanta? I'm Bo. I'm the art director for the Georgia Boys. And this is a cranberry vodka. able to provide more services for our homeless kids. Alright, we've got the manager Ray and Julio from Boy Next Door. You guys, tell me what this win means for Best Clothing Store. Oh, it's great. This is three years in a row that we've been able to provide a great service to the community and the community has shown us uh, by nominating us for this award that it, it works. It's great. We're here with Justin Ziegler who won the 2000 12 Georgia Voice Best of Atlanta Best Realtor. Justin, tell me what it means for you. Woo! It means my people love me and I love my people. All right, we got Amber Taylor, the 2012 Best Musician. Amber, tell me why this means so much to you. All right, I got DJ Vicky Powell here. She's fun for tonight's party. She's won three years in a row, and this year you were the number one top vote getter. You got more votes than any other. to serve all those drinks without doing one for you and two for me, darling. Thanks everyone for coming out. We hope you loved the best of party just as much as we do and we totally look forward to celebrating and inebriating our community again in the future very soon. In sh** that totally freaked out mainstream media but you already knew, Anderson Cooper is gay now. Oh wait, no, he's always been and always will be and he couldn't be any more happy. Wait, always been gay? Been gay, get it, been gay? I guess I get that he came out on his own time, but delaying the inevitable suggests that gay people, even really hot, famous, rich journalist ones, should be hesitant to come out even under the cushiest circumstances. As a hot, famous, and rich journalist myself, I believe this is not the case. I'm with Harvey Milk on this one. Come out, come out wherever you are, especially if you have two television shows and come from one of America's richest families. The library is now closed. Because you just got rid, you silver fox, Anderson Cooper. Um, have you seen this guy on the corner of Amsterdam and Monroe twirling the sign for Urban Body Fitness? Twirl the sign! Twirl the sign! Twirl the sign! Twirl the sign! I'll have four of what he's having because I need the energy. Thanks for tuning in to another edition of Georgia Voice's Hot Minute. For more information on these stories and more, check out thegavoice.com. Oh, give me that baby. Thanks for tuning in to another week of Georgia Voice's Hot Minute. For more information on these stories and more, check out thegavoice.com. Isn't that right? Yay! All done. <laughs> All done. <laughs>